and today I'm going to be showing you a collective haul that includes items that I ordered from Hilt Look and a Sephora.com order that was placed during the, um, the VIB Rouge sale where you got 15% off. Um, we'll start with the um, Hilt Look order. Um, this was done when they had the bomb on which was gosh back in February I think and if you don't know what Hope Look is, it's a, a website that you sign up. There's no fee to sign up for it. Um, it's sponsored by Nordstrom. And every day they have different flash sales. And they'll have um, beauty items, um, home decor, clothing, accessories, um, men's, children's, women's, just a lot of different things. And it's brands that you're very familiar with and a lot of times they're at least 50% off. The only thing with Hot Look is that it does take a long time for them to ship their items. So if you're looking at something on there and you think that would make a great birthday gift and say the birthday is in a couple weeks, don't order it for that because you won't get it in time because it can take four to six weeks, eight weeks to get products in. Um, there's been occasions where um, they've ran out before they were able to fill my order so I didn't get my product but they refunded my money back obviously but then they also gave me like a ten dollar credit to use toward another purchase. Okay I'm back. I had to take a phone call from my husband. Um, one of our employees at the other business is birthdays today and we're having steaks out on the grill even though it's like 40 degrees out today for his birthday. Yesterday it was like almost 80 degrees and today it's right now I just went to the bank and my temperature in my car said 44 degrees so yeah it's cold. Like I had to find a sweater to pin on. It doesn't even go with what I got on but I was cold. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get back to what we're all here for, and that's to see what I purchased. So we'll start with um, what I got from Hot Look, as I was saying earlier. And I did order a lipstick, and this is called Read My Lips by The Balm, and it's in the color Gossip. And uh, the packaging is just so cute. It just looks like, you know, pieces of um, a vintage newspaper. And I did. I got this in the mail yesterday. Even the package, the tube is like that. Isn't that cute? And the lipstick looks like this here. And you think, you know, that's a really pretty color. You know, that's but that has no pigment to it whatsoever. I tried swatching this yesterday when I got it in the mail in the car. I mean, look, look at this. You can see how much I'm rubbing this, right? And that's all I got right there. There's no, there's no pigment to that at all. It's like a gloss. So I'm a little disappointed with that. And unfortunately, a lot of times with Hot Look, especially their cosmetics, um, all sales are final on those, so I can't send it back. But anyway, it is what it is. And I think this was $8. I think it was around between $8 and $10 on that. But then I got, they had the Instant Stain um, blushes. Look at those. I mean, just for the packaging alone, these are so cute. I'm going to hold it here so maybe I'll get a good thumbnail. Huh. Instead of one of me looking down all the time. Yeah. Anyway, this is the Insta Stain. Insta Stain. Oh, say that again. Look at that. Look at that girl. That looks like my daughter. Oh, this was in the color Argyle. And even, see this is the sleeve, even the little packaging, the box itself is cute like that. And then the argyle print around, and then this pretty pink. Look at that. That is so pretty. That's that right there. Super cute. Oh, and it has a mirror too. It has a mirror, and it has a little saying up here. It says, wear it well. And then it says it again in, um, I'm going to assume it's, it's in French. I don't speak French, but it looks French to me. Uh, maybe someone else can speak French. Anyway, so that is that one. That was in the color Argyle. And these were $11 is the price on these. 
And then this one, this girl looks like Jasmine to me off of Aladdin. Yeah. And this is in the color lace. So guess what? Yes, around the edge here is lace. And this is the color there. That's that color. So that's definitely more of a um, purpley pink. This is more of a softer pink. With a little bit more of a mauve color in it. Okay. And then this one says wear it well also on the little mirror. And then the last one I got is this one here. And she just looks so glamorous. And this one is in the color toil. Tool. Tool. But just look at that. Isn't that pretty? I love just the packaging alone is so pretty. That's the color there. This one definitely will have to be careful when wearing this or so I'm going to get way too much. That's that right there. It's beautiful. Pretty, pretty colors. I love them. They're so pretty. So I'm glad that I was able to get those. Um, and then I also got a um, cute uh, little stamp. Blah. I can't even talk. I got my mind on that steak. That's what the problem is. I'm looking forward to eating a steak. Anyway, I got these little swab samples. Shampoo, conditioner, and a, um, a leave-in cream in the natural infusion with the awape, ginger, and honeysuckle. And then also a coupon for a dollar off. This was also in with my Hope Look order. All right. So now we'll get started with the um, stuff that I bought from Sephora. And I ordered this online. I wanted to go to the the VIB Rouge event that they were having on Sunday from 9 to 11 and I actually did sign up for it and was going I was planning on going but my son and his girlfriend came in for the weekend so I opted to stay home and visit with them as opposed to going makeup shopping so yeah so I ordered online and I didn't go too crazy because I really didn't need a whole lot but one of the things I did order, and I was wanting to get this, and I actually went in a few weeks before when my daughter and I had our girls' day out and got a sample of this. And it's the Bite Beauty Agave Lip Mask right here. And this was $26, and to me that was pretty pricey for a, a lip treatment. But... I will tell you this, um, if you can see in some of my previous videos, I was having a really hard time, a lot of issues with my lips being chapped, especially here in the corners. I mean, it looked horrible. It looked horrible. I shouldn't have been doing videos with my lips looking like that. But when I got my sample of this, after two nights of using this, it was all gone. It was cleared up, so definitely going to be worth it. So I'm, yes, glad I got that. And this in the little... Um, a little squeezy tube right here and it's a very 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 thick product and I've heard some people say it's really hard to get um, squeezed out of this little tin but it's worth it I'm telling you it's worth it I, I didn't think that it would work that good that's why I got a sample of it to see and I was glad I got it when my lips were at their worst that they have ever been in my entire life and it, it yeah it took really good care of it. I think part of my issue too is I had started using um, Retina A back in January and I think when I've been putting it on I've been getting it too close to this part here and I think it was really irritating here so when I put this this lip mask on I don't just put it on my lips I put it all the way around <laughs> so I have like a big shiny thing but I don't care I just put it all the way around and that helps to keep that um, retina A cream from getting over into this area that's really sensitive. Okay, enough of that. I also ordered a Hourglass Ambient Powder in the um, color Ethereal Light. Um, the only other ones I have are the, the little trio that was in that limited edition palette at Christmas. So I didn't have this one. And I wanted this to maybe use to set... Um, my under eye 
concealer. I didn't use any powder this morning. I was in a hurry. My little grandson stayed with me last night. and I tell you what, you girls that have babies and little ones at home and get up and put your makeup on and do videos, I, I admire you because I've been totally stressed all morning because I forgot half the stuff I wanted to put on. I was trying to keep him out of everything and hurry. Whew, it's a mess. Anyway, and then the other two things I ordered was some Makeup Forever um, lipsticks, the liquid lipsticks. Um, the Aqua Rouge. I really, I don't know. Anyway, they look like this here. Gosh, they got the little lip gloss on the end, which I will tell you I don't ever use these. And then this, the lip stain on the side. And these, these, I love the formula, this formulation. It's my favorite formulation of lipstick. Uh, MAC does a really good one. Uh, Makeup Forever does a good one. And Avon used to do a really good one, but they discontinued them unless they come back with them. But this is in the color 19. It doesn't have a name. There might be a name on the website. I don't remember. Let's see if it says on my packing slip. Okay. Number 19 is pomegranate. <clears throat> Which this doesn't look pomegranate to me, but maybe. That's it right there. They smell so good. They almost have like a, a powdery scent to them. It's not vanilla at all. But, hmm. Smells good. So that was number 19, and then the other color I got is number 10, which is raspberry. And if you look in the package, I mean, they almost look pretty similar to each other. Pretty darn close. But anyway, this is number 10. Which is this one right there. So that's raspberry. So I have those two. So I got those. And then I cashed in a 500 point perk. And um, on the website, I couldn't, for some reason, I couldn't tell what was in it. But from the little picture I could see, it looked like products that I would like. So I went ahead and got it. And I'm so glad that I did. It comes in this little pouch, this little quilted makeup pouch right here, which I just think looks so chic. And classy. And wait till you see what was in here. Oh, I was, wow. First of all, there was a sample of the Hourglass Mineral Veil Primer, which is wonderful. This is probably one of the best primers I've ever used. Had that in there. It also has a little sample of the Josie Marion 100% Pure Argon Oil. And this is in a um, 0.16 fluid ounce. So that's a pretty good size bottle right there. The argon oil, because it doesn't take very much of this stuff at all to put on to your face or on your hair, wherever you want to use it, your body. It also had a rose botanical um, perfume, and I can't pronounce what which one it is, so I'm just going to put it right up there. Let you read it. And this smells really good. I like this. And it's a really generous sample. I mean, look at that. Look how big that is. Woo! Almost dropped it and broke it. Yep. Yep. Pretty good size. So that's quite a bit for a little sample. Does it say a millimeter ounce? Oh, it may, but oh, right. Here it is. It's um, 0.13 ounces. So that's, that's pretty good. That's quite a bit. And then it had in it, also from Bite Beauty, a lip pencil in the color pomegranate. This right here. I mean, so how cool is that for just, you know, an extra perk? Look at that color. Isn't that pretty? Let's put it next to this other one that they said was pomegranate. Right there. This one's pomegranate, and this one, this they say, is pomegranate. See, this to me is more pomegranate than what that is but anyway I didn't name them so they didn't ask me they didn't call me up on the phone and say hey you know what should we name this color they should have ha huh. anyway okay the last thing I have is from Revlon and I got this at Walmart 
is $4.97 and it is the color number 674 Coral Berry. And it is really pretty. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. And right there. I was out of Diet Coke this morning and so the only thing we had in the house to drink was a Mountain Dew. And I'll never drink Mountain Dew and I just feel like I'm about ready to bounce off the walls. Just feel like I could go out there and just run 10 miles. No, not really. <laughs> anyway. So that's it for my haul. Um, only I have another Sephora order that's coming, but it only has one thing in it. So I'm going to just tell you what it is. I'm not going to do it in a separate video. And it's just the Marc Jacobs um, concealer brush. I did go ahead and order that at a later date. But that is all that I ordered for the... Um, the VIB Rouge sale. And I also have another Hot Look order coming. And after that, that should be, probably will be my last haul for a little while. Just because I need to slow down a little bit. So anyway, that's it. I do appreciate it. And thank you for watching. And don't forget to subscribe. That helps me a lot. Anyway, have a great day.